the Dark Angel, we're at 57, and welcome back to Undertale. I uh, made it all the way back to the hotel, I got my 10 extra HP, and I lost it on the way back. But I've got some more healing items. And I cheated and did some research online and figured out how to freaking get past this chickadee. So I assume it's a chickadee. I think it's a chickadee. For our purposes, it's a chickadee. Unless they tell me otherwise. Some of those get so close, I don't think it should count. I don't remember how close that thing is. Hey, what's up? I was just thinking, you, me, and Undyne should all hang out sometime. I think you would make great pals. Let's meet up at her house later. I don't remember what voice I gave him. 
And that's how they get by Undyne. <laughs> Where did you go? Alright. I'm going to proceed forward. That took way too long. Whoa. Okay. okay. I was thirsty, so I came over from Waterfall to get a drink. Evaporated. The cup evaporated too. Um. Seeing such a strange laboratory in a place like this, you're filled with determination. Laboratory. Well, Anna, I am the river man. Or am I the river woman? It doesn't really matter. I'd love to ride my boat. Would you care to join me? Where will we go today? Snowden or... Oh, awesome! Snowden! And then I'll come straight back. But this is nice. So much easier than what I had to do to get back last time. Why don't you sing with me? Tra la la! Come again sometime, tra la la. Yes, please. Let's go back to the Hotland and proceed. Why are we going that way? Isn't the Hotland the other way? Tra la la, Temi Village, the room before the darkening. Yeah, I've been there. Full of ghosties. And a friggin' snail race that I can't win. How about over here? Oh, there's the lab. It's you? It's too dark to see. You look human. Oh, not anymore. Oh my god. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. I haven't showered. I'm barely dressed. It's all messy and... Um, hiya. I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's royal scientist. But, 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 but uh, I'm, I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've um, been observing your journey through my console. Your fights, your friendships, everything. I was originally going to stop you, but watching someone on a stream really makes you root for them. So, so uh, now I want to help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. Well... Actually, um, it was just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Mipton. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. 
Anyway, recently I decided to make him more useful. You know, just some small practical adjustments. Like, um, anti-human combat features. Of course, when I saw you some coming, I immediately decided I had to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have tated, made a teensy mistake while doing so, and um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood. <laughs> but um, hopefully, we won't run into him. Did you hear something? I want that conveniently shaped lamp back, please. Oh no. Oh yes. Welcome, beauties. Today's quiz show. I can already tell it's going to be a great show. Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestants. Never played before, gorgeous? No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly, or you die. Screaming is against the rules. Let's start with an easy one. What's the prize for answering correctly? More questions. Right, sounds like you get it. Here's your terrific prize. What is the king's full name? Asgore Draymond. Correct! What a terrific answer! Enough about you, let's talk about me. What are robots made out of? Metal and magic? Too easy for ya, huh? Two trains train A and B simultaneously depart a station. You suck! Hey, I still had time left! How many flies are in this jar? You suck! Let's go 53. Completely, utterly wrong. Cinnabon! monster is this? That's a froggit! That's a froggit! Bicycle. Would you smooch a ghost? Heck yeah! Great answer! I love it! How many letters in the name? Correct! That was way too easy for you. Oh my gosh. In a dating simulation video game, Mew Mew Kissy Cutie, what is Mew Mew's favorite food? She buys ice cream for all of her friends, but it's snail flavor and she's the only one who wants it. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? You should have told me. I'll ask a question you'll be sure to know the answer to. Who does Dr. Alphys have a crush on? Undyne. See, Alphys, I told you it was obvious. Even the human figured it out. Yes, she scrawls her name in the margins of her notes. She names program variables after her. She even writes stories of them together. Sharing a domestic life. Probability of crush, 101%. Margin of error, 1%. Well, 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 with Dr. Alphys helping you, the show has no traumatic tension. We can't go on like this. But, but, this is just the pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. Until next time, darlings. So, Undyne is female. That was certainly something. Wait, wait! 
Let me give you my phone number. This, then this, maybe if you need help, I could... Where'd you get that phone? It's ancient! It doesn't even have texting! Wait a second, please. Here, I upgraded it for you. It can do texting, items, it's got a keychain. I even signed you up for the Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> I'm going to the bathroom. A cute garbage can. Instant noodles and soda. Yep. Yellow feet are tapping just behind the door. Pink goop drips from a strange machine. And a single clean dress. Lots of letters from any monsters. Froggy, Snowy, Doggo, they're all unopened. An incredible invention. When not in use, this bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. I want the bed! Alright, there's more to do this way. Okay. Just realized I didn't watch Undyne fight the human. Oh. Oh. Well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. For now, I gotta call the human and guide them. Vulcan. Encourage. It's doing a great job. Gonna call them in a minute. Just call me then. It fills you with determination. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this. in the way, not on purpose or anything. Flirt. You, you sicko. <laughs> Accidentally bumps you with its wing. Approach it. But not too close. Human? like you or anything, Baka. <laughs> okay. Oh, looks like there's more down that way, but let's go. I've had my claw over the last digit for five minutes. I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna call. 
No, you're not. There we go. They hung up before you answered it. Oh my gosh. Uh, hi. So, the blue lasers. Uh, I mean, Alpha's here. Hi. The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. Orange ones, um, you have to be moving and they, um, they won't, um, move through those ones. Uh, bye. Oh my gosh, I did it! Claws haven't shook like that since I... Wait, there's no water down here. Why did she call me? Ow! No more lasers. Oh my god, I forgot to tell them where to go. Cute pic of me right now. It's a photo of a garbage can with several pink glittery filters over it. Uh, Alpha's here. The, the northern door will stay locked until you solve the puzzles on the right and the left. I, I think you should go to the right first. I wonder if it would be unfun if I explained the puzzle. The way to work is blocked, so I had to catch the Metaton show on my phone. The special effects were amazing today. The human almost looked real. Metaton? Yeah, he's the most popular star in the underground. His band club probably has at least two, no, three dozen members. The door leading to the area is closed, so I tried the puzzle, but I kept running out of ammo. I kept restarting. My two co-workers won't help. It's like they don't even want to go to work. Shoot the opposing ship. Move the boxes to complete your mission. That was it? side. Alpha's here. That blue laser seems totally impassable, but as the royal scientist, I have some tricks up my sleeve. I'll hack into the hot laser database and take it out. How about you guys? We were hanging out when suddenly a bunch of puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. This is a huge problem. It rules. They've got to cancel school over this. Finally, someone turned off that laser. Now we're free... We can, well, I guess we'll just keep standing here. Same thing? Okay. puzzles. Awesome! Uh, let's get to a save point. Whatever, I'll just explain it. Uh, I think, um, hey, about the puzzles on the left and right. They're a bit difficult to explain, but uh, you already solved them? Awesome! Hey, it's kind of dark in there, isn't it? Don't worry. I'll hack into the light system and brighten it up. Oh no. Oh yes! Welcome, beauties, to the Underground's premiere cooking show. Cooking with a killer robot. 
preheat your ovens because we've got a very special recipe for you today. We're going to be making a cake. A lovely, my lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Everyone, please give them a big hand. We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart. Great job, just put them in the middle of this counter. Perfect, great job, beautiful. We've got all of the ingredients we need to bake the cake. Milk, sugar, eggs, oh my, what a magnificent moment, how could I forget? We're missing the most important ingredient. A human soul. Hello, I'm kind of in the middle of something here. W wait a second. Couldn't you make a... Couldn't you use a... Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? A substitution? You mean use a different non-human ingredient? Why? Uh, what if someone's... Vegan? Vegan. Well, uh, I mean, that's a brilliant idea, Alphys! Actually, I happen to have an option right here! MTT brand Always Convenient Human Soul Flavored Substitute. A can of which just over on that counter. I'm worried. Well, darling, why don't you go get it? By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get to the next... In the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. So, you better start climbing, beautiful! Oh no, there's not enough time to climb up. Fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your phone, I added a few features. You see that huge button that says Jetpack? Watch this. There. You should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Now, get up there. Stop dropping shit on me. Crap. Uh, I'm only halfway. good at these sorts of things. There's just too much going on. I can't focus. Ah. My, my. It seems you've bested me, but only because you had the help of a brilliant Dr. Alphys. Oh, I loathe to think what would happen to you without her. Well, toodles. Oh, no. Oh, yes, about the substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it. <laughs> forget it. Uh... We, we did it. We, we really did it. Great job out there, team. W well, uh, anyway, let's keep heading forward. Alright, now that I've got this save, I'm going to cut the episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, give me a thumbs up, give me some comments, let me know how I'm doing, and I will see you all in the next episode. Till then, bye bye